one, I'm going to show you how to find common denom um, denominators and fractions. Let me put this. Sorry. Alright. This black. Alright, so for example, we're going to do one fourth and two fifths. So you're going to do four times one is four, four times two is eight, four times three is 12, four times four is 16, four times five is 20. Let's stop there. And for, let me just do one thing. And for five, It's 5 times 1 is 5, 5 times 2 is 10, 5 times 3 is 15, 5 times 4 is 20. Now, none of these matches these. The only one that match is 20, so we want to pick the least, and this is the least because that's all we can find. There might be more, but... Um, we want to find the least one, so this is the one we're going to choose. It's 20. Now, let me just erase this. So, we know that it's going to be 20. So, let me erase all of this. This doesn't write. Don't ask. Um, now, now, we, we're going to use one fourth. So, we're going to do this. So, we did four times five. So, whatever you do to the bottom is what you do to the top. And that's one, I mean, oops, five. 20 it's if you want to do it for two fifths you are going to do let me do it here uh, let me make it big uh times times so five times four so we have to do it here too and then that equals eight two times four is eight and 5 times 4 is 20, so it's 820. I think if, yeah, this is more or less than this, so I would pick this, but you can pick any of it. We're going to try one more, and yeah, we're going to try one more, and then we're going to, I'm going to end the video. So let me just erase everything while the camera is off. And if you forgot how my sister looks like, I'm just going to show her real quick. <laughs> yeah, and... You can go check out our channel, Shafi Dean Ahmed. So yeah, it sounds a little weird, but... <laughs> yeah, that's our dad. I don't know why I'm talking about that. We're going to try one more. Let's, we're going to do... Uh, let's do one... Mm, okay, let's do... Um... Six 
tanks and eight mm, and let's do eight twenty. Now that's gonna be easy because well you'll see because if you think about your multiplication facts, it's going to be pretty easy. Ooh, ow. Now, so, so it's gonna, we're going to do the 10 and 10, 20. Do you, oh yeah, guys, do you like our doll video better videos better or our songs videos and since this is the first math video we're gonna count the math video with the song video comment down below Ooh, 20 okay yeah 10 20 so the first one is 20 so that's pretty good so we're just gonna circle both of them since we know don't ask why it's so bad. I'm holding the camera at the same time. That's why. And. Oh. Don't want my iPad to Okay. And so we're going to do. Since six. Okay. So six tenths. We're going to need two. So we're going to do two. Because that equals 20. So it's 20, 12, um, I mean 12, 20, um, 20, and over here, 8, 8, so it's going to be the same because, wait, well, let me show you because I'm confused, but since we just used the 20 for the first one, it's just going to be 1, so we're going to do the same thing here, and it's 8. 20th. Now, let me just erase all of this so I can do one more thing. It's not a problem or anything. Well, I'm not going to do it with you this time, but this time, I want you guys. Let me just erase this here. Woo, our pink curtains. Wee hee. Okay. Um. Wee bee wee bee wee bee. Let's say racy racy racy. Woo! My sister. All I want you guys to do now is. Hold on. So all I want you guys to do now is. Is this this problem try it yourself and let me know in the comments what you get actually no let's not do one let's do something else oh my finger it's not that bad but okay, whatever um do two eight gotta make sure it's not equivalent and three fifths I'm sure that's not equivalent yeah, it's not equivalent. So I want you guys to find the common denominator for this. And write it in the comments below. And, um, um, yeah, and an easy way to find equivalent fractions, just real quick, I'm going to show you, like one half. 2 times, you're going to do diagonally, so 2 times, let's do 4, and that's 8. And something that will equal 8, which is 8, so 8 times 1 is 8. That should help you to find equivalent, I can't write it, so, but you know, equivalent fractions, so yeah. Hold on, one more thing I want you guys to do is...
is good. Like and subscribe. Bye. That was my sister. Say bye. Yeah, bye. And make sure you like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. Wait. One more thing. I don't know how to make a notification bell, but there is my notification bell. Bye.